What is up, everybody? It's the Game Dex here. We are here with a brand new, maybe potential series, Pokemon Reboot. What if Pokemon was made in 2021? Now, if you guys have been on the interwebs, you will have seen some people playing this game. Um, and if you're actually fully inter wind with the interwebs you would have been on instagram and you probably have seen this amazing instagram channel channel page create just completely redesign all of gen 1 they're on gen 2 right now but they completely redesigned all of gen 1 and just modernized them and this other person took it and made it into the game they redesigned the sprites, but the original Instagram channel redesigned, rebooted the Pokemon. So, we're going to get into that. Um, I say potential series because I might be doing slight change content. But we can, we can explain that in a little bit. Hello there! Glad to meet you. Welcome to the world of the slowest text ever. Pokemon, my name is Oak, and people affectionately refer to me as the Pokemon Professor this world is inhabited by this Nidoran that has a big, bulky head. Oh my. For some people, Pokemon are pests, some are fouling ass. For myself, I study Pokemon as a profession. Look at that Pokeball! They redesigned the Pokeballs too, and it's actually kind of cool. Because if I'm not mistaken, they actually designed the Pokeballs based on the, the Instagram page design of um, Voltorb. I could be wrong, I could be wrong. We'll eventually see that later. What is my name? It is three letters. It is D E X the Game Dex. As little as I post, I still remember it. Right here, so your name is Dex. It is Dex. Your very own Pokemon adventure is about to unfold. A world of dreams and adventures with Pokemon awaits. Let's go. Let's get into this. Um the cool part oops. The cool part about this game is I know, there it is. I'm, I'm so used to playing the newer generations. You know what, I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna keep, I'm gonna keep the frame. Go OG frame, it's a reboot. It's nothing special, we're not doing a Nuzlocke. We're gonna keep it very simple, just playing the game like normal. And I think in today's episode, at least we're gonna get to the first gym. Look at Pallet Town. It looks so good. They they redesign and the grass. Hey, wait! Don't go out. This game looks so good. I'm. It's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. I mean, it's the same exact story. I'm pretty sure. I I've partially watched some people play, so I know some Pokemon. I've scrolled through the Instagram account. I'm followed. It's in the description, so you guys can check it out too. Gramps, I'm fed up with waiting. Green. I didn't get to nickname him, did I? I don't think I nicknamed my rival. Let me think. Oh, that's right. I told you to come. Just wait. Here, Dex. There are three Pokemon here. Haha. -ha. The Pokemon are held inside these Pokeballs. When I was young, I was a serious Pokemon trainer. But now, in my old age, I only have three left. Go on. Choose one. Green. Green. You better chill. We got Squirtle here. Squirtle's all right. Uh, I mean, ranks same on the Squirtle page. The worst. Squirtle is the worst. Then we got Bulbasaur here. He's so happy. Um, he's he's pretty cool. But how can I not go with my boy Charmander? We are going with my boy Charmander. That would just be a crime. Uh, no nickname. No nicknames, actually. No, no, no nicknames. We'll go straight and original. Nothing special. And let's get into this battle. Wait, Dex, let's check out our Pokemon. Come on, I'll take you on. But I do have to apologize for a little bit of a break. Um, just just dealing weeks, week with some things. But I do hope to get back on it. I do want to play more Pokemon. Um, I did say it's going to be slightly different. Because we're going to... Instead of going full series episodes... It does sometimes kill the motivation just watching like a series that you work a lot on, like building the disc, the overlay, um, doing a daily series of it, 
just watching like the support for it dwindle completely down I know it partially has to do with the fact that uh, let's plays aren't really let's plays aren't ooh, a crit they're not really popping anymore and I, I said it I feel like I said it on this channel when I was coming back back in like September October is that when I started picking up my videos again and I was like yeah let's let's plays just aren't happening people are more into a series that they can just quickly watch and just be done with maybe like similar game styles like the people that do like the solo Pokemon but they beat the whole game in one episode and let's take a look look at this big head Pidgey I kind of want one I know I got Charmander I know I got Charmander but I always used to Pidgeot in my games I might have to but yeah people are very much more into the shorter series and I, I think at most, I mean, sometime, maybe there'll be a couple episodes where we cut it to like two gyms, because the middle of the game gets very scrunched in gyms. So it wouldn't like if I did a gym per episode, those middle gyms would be like pop, 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 done. Like Brock, Misty, uh, Lieutenant Surge, maybe, but we could potentially combine Lieutenant Surge. It's just got so much content. So we'll see how this type of series goes. We'll beat a gym. Uh, maybe do some Nuzlocks here and there. Um, if you guys do want to see that Pokemon Black Nuzlocke still, you guys can still let me know. And probably like the biggest like reason why I, like I feel like this might be the way to go is just some a specific youtuber that I've actually watched a little bit recently it's kind of how he's doing it and it like it seems right it's it seems good like it's working for him I know you're not supposed to be a copier you're supposed to pioneer your own ideas but if this direction that polka tubing is going then rather than staying behind in the back at least pick it up now other things I want to explore and try to do is those like series that it's like one like playing the whole game and just editing it into one episode just because you only have to watch one episode you don't have to worry about catching up on a series like episode six you're not like oh what what did I miss okay okay green what are you Okay, I, I I don't remember there being three professor aids, but I could be wrong. Now let me let me catch let me catch my Pidgey. Let me catch my Pidgey. Okay, a Rattata. Look at this guy. You know, I'd be down to actually catch everything. Just have like a little like show off episode at the end, being like, hey, the these are the accounts, but you guys can go on the account too. So. Maybe I just grind it up on my free time, be like, ooh, do I want to use that? Uh, Rattata? Most likely not. Most likely not. But, you know, you know, it's it's worth catching. Now give me, give me, give me my boy Pidgey. There he is. There he is. Okay, come on. Stay in the ball. One shake, two shake, three shake. Caught it. Caught it. Welcome, 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 Pidgey. Now they didn't change any typing. They didn't change any of the abilities. They didn't do any of that changing. It's just a complete reboot. So it's pure to the nature. Just a reboot. It. Look at our Pidgey. It's decent. It's decent. Now, okay, Rattata. Now that being said, there is there is some more Pokemon's we can encounter. A Mankey. I saw a Mankey in someone's playthrough, and I'm like, 
boy do I want to use a make you look how cool he is he's got like the actual like brawling like fists ready to take everyone down add it to the team I might use a Mankey too now maybe it's maybe I'll swap out Pokemon in between gyms and we'll just build like a team for the gym um, maybe minus like Charmander maybe we keep Charmander Rattata Sandshrew. Interesting. Now, I don't think Sandshrew ever was on this route in Fire Red and Leaf Green, so I think I was wrong. There is a few route changes. We're gonna catch a Sandshrew too. I don't think... I think Spearow got removed from here, so... We don't have any other Pokemon to worry about on this route, if I'm not mistaken. Um, if we catch the Sandshrew, I'll may maybe I'll do a little skip ahead to just test. Hey, look. He was caught. Okay, I'm gonna see if there is any more potential mods on this route, and I'll be a little right back. I was wrong. Spiro is here. Look at my boy Spiro. He is actually... I like the Spiro design way more than the Spiro. Way more than regular Spiro. Spiro's okay. He's edgy. Um, me personally, I'm not the biggest fan of Spiro. If I have to choose a Gen 1 bird, it was Pidgey, the Pidgey line, the Doduo line, and then Spiro. I've never actually really used Doduo either. I think I've actually used a Firo more times than I used a Doduo, but I... Just because of how late in the game. Sandshrew, what are you doing standing up? Chill. I mean, I guess it's normal Sprite stands up. It's just weird to see... I ran out of Pokeballs. Not not pro gaming moves here. Okay. I managed to catch that Spearow, and I did actually do some grinding. Look, look, I got Mankey. Mankey level 6. Charmander 7. Spearow 6. Rattata 4. Pidgey 6. And Sandshrew 6. I did realize uh, near the end of my training that I probably should only be training with the Mons that I want to use. Because there's still... Uh, Caterpie, Weedle. Um, I think I'd be better off going into the woods to catch them. But there's still Caterpie, Weedle, and Pikachu, technically, that we can catch. Gotta, gotta get that item. Look at Caterpie! Oh, he's so amazing. Oh, he's so amazing. Like, it's just... I mean, Caterpie is so, like iconic like regular Caterpie but this guy still looks pretty good too like no jokes or I guess girl this 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 little Caterpie looks pretty good too um, I did I mean I've seen most of these uh, vague memories of most of these I don't quite remember them all because it's been like years since I've seen the Kanto Pokemon on their account I and watching people play, of course. So, slight memories. I mean, as we get further into the game, the memories will disappear. But I do remember not being too big of a fan of Weedle. No joke. If I if I remember correctly, yeah. Look at look at this guy. He's just a spike ball, and that's not the button I want to click. We, we, we can catch we can catch a weedle we can catch a weedle nice nice easy plays and you know what we can nice easy play it and weedle no we're gonna we're gonna just nice easy play it we don't need to spend too much time in viridian forest we've got plans to go come on let's battle them we've got plans we got to get the pewter Rick and his Weedle, his spiky, spike top little thing. 
don't stand a chance against my Charmander. Just saying. You know, I do have a cool nickname idea. It's going to be forever before we can change them. Because that's uh, Lavender Town. But if you guys have, like, reboot names, I guess. Like, things you could call. Ooh, we can get to see a Caterpie in action. Things that you would, like, call these mods, I guess. Since they're not exactly Charmander. They're not exactly Caterpie. They're, they're different. They're reboots. So, I mean, modern... Pokemon in from the past need modern names for the in the past ones, right? And how did I avoid that trainer? I guess I one spot. Our 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 Charmander just whoa whoa uh man what is Kakuna? What is up with you? Are you are you okay? Charmander, <laughs> you're getting a little too strong. You know, we, we do have a Mon that can handle these. His name's Spiro. He's got Peck. See, look, look, no, no worries. I really wish we got running shoes. You know what, in a modern reboot of this game, we would get running shoes straight off the bat. We wouldn't have to wait until beating Brock. Like, how do people get stay into this? I mean, I love Pokemon. Fire Red was my first game, so... I guess I found some way to stay interested. Just this this whole not being able to run. It's, it's awful, and there's... I don't, why, I don't need to level you, Spiro. There's a potion right there. They moved the trainer, but they didn't move the potion. Hey, wait, what's the hurry? Why the rush? Because I gotta get to Brock. Not really, because I want to catch one more guy. I want to catch one more guy. Yo, look at, look at this Jigglypuff. He's a balloon. He's a balloon! Oh, you know that actually... Jigglypuff, also an iconic Mon. But you can't tell me a balloon Jigglypuff isn't great. I mean, Jigglypuff's so iconic that he's in Smash. But still. Still. Rattata, you're going away. I want to keep Pidgey. I want to see Pidgey evolve. Sanshu, if you got better moves, sure. No, we don't we don't need Pidgey right now. We don't really need Spiro either. I'm I'm, I'm fine I'm fine with this trio. And before people go, why why Caterpie? Because confusion. You, come on, don't don't you you can't be playing an old version of the game and not know uh, the strats. We're playing by the strats. I actually kind of want to grind in here just for the sake of getting Pikachu and I'll come back for Caterpie's evolution I'll come back for Pikachu but until then we're gonna we're gonna skip straight ahead to Brock well not I, I guess not I didn't even skip there's no skip there you guys can be just watching me hit the speed up button there's no skip there look at Pikachu He's, he's skinny already. He's not a fat, chonky Pikachu immediately off the bat. And Pikachu, I don't want to actually take you out. Oh, I don't, I don't want to, I don't want to take him out. One more. Pokeball. Stay in. Hey, hey, look at Pikachu. He's actually kind of, he's, he's pretty, he's, I, I, I like him. I'm not going to train him. We don't need to train him just yet, but I like him. My boy! My boy! Trust me, training this Caterpie is awful. It is horrendous. He can't fight a Rattata to save his life. But it'll be worth it. Metapod, you're still gonna be pretty useless in the training. 
but now now we just gotta now we just gotta wait wait for Butterfree. So if you chuck enough meta if you chuck enough metapods, if you chuck metapod into enough things, do you think it evolved? Do you think if you just could pick it up and just yeet it towards something, it would just start flashing and turning into a Butterfree? Let's take a look at this Butterfree, though. Why, 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 why are you so derpy? Butterfree, what did they do to you? No, I, I really don't like it. I don't, oops, I don't like the Butterfree. It looks like a Disney character. Now, in a Disney setting, sure, that wouldn't be bad, but in the sake of a Pokemon reboot... Oh! Uh, I mean, not... Not really my forte, if I'm, if I'm being honest. Um, I got Mankey to 12, Charmander 13. This should be perfectly fine, I know. I won't worry about the item. I know Butterfree's not going to be doing much. I, I really just kind of wanted to get one of the bugs up the level, and Butterfree was the one I typically always used. I have always avoided Beedrill. Wasn't a fan. Was not a fan. Geodude? Ooh, I, I like this Geodude. Just the gemstones coming out of it? Hold up. Geodude, who told you that you could look this good? Okay, Butterfree, I'm sorry. Sorry for offending you. I was gonna say out loud, I'm s who who told you that you could look this good against my derpy Butterfree, but my Butterfree went all in before I even had the chance to say it out loud. Sandshrew. Okay. Okay, Butterfree, do you think you can handle Sandshrew too? I do like Sandshrew's design. It's just, without rebooting their move pools... It's, it's just, Sanchu's move pools are so bad. And I say that, and I remember my... In a Nuzlocke, me getting absolutely destroyed by a Sanchu by saying that. It's true. Um, don't let my humiliating defeat prove anything about that differently. What? But, Bri, I thought you learned... I thought you learned the Stunt Spore Sleep Powder shenanigans when you evolved. Is it level 12? Are we gonna miss out on that? Okay, Butterfree. You did it to one Geodude. Now here's your chance to shine. I, I, I still like Geodude's design more than you, Butterfree, but if you could prove me wrong. If you could absolutely destroy this Geodude in two hits again. It ain't happening. <sighs> Disappointed, Butterfree. I'm not. I, I'm not. I mean, design-wise, a little bit. But you know, overall, you did. You did pretty good. You did good. You did good. No, Geodude holding you back. Onyx, on the other hand. Onyx, on the other hand. That's why we got this boy. This crazy manky man. And oh my, why does on? I like this Onyx. Hold up, why does Onyx look like that sandworm from that one game that we all used to play as a kid? You know you know. Here we go. Onyx, you look too good just to have your attack stat to be garbage. I'm sorry. I'm sorry for saying that, but Pokemon in Gen 1, unbalanced as can be. Get out of here, Onyx. Well, actually, I think that was the issue, is... They had to make Onyx be too balanced for the beginning of the game, but they just, they hurt my boy. And look at Brock, he, he, he looks pretty good too. I took you for granted, and so I lost. As proof of your victory, I confer to you this official Pokemon League Boulder badge. And I think, I think this is actually the place that we wrap up our first episode. Thank you guys for watching, if you've made it this far. Um... To go along with this whole, like, hey, if this if the series is worth, like, if, if the series is getting enough, enough enticing in the game, like, people want to watch the game, I'll keep doing this until we beat the game. I'm going to go with a view goal of seven views. Let's try seven views. 
three likes. Seven views, three likes. And I will continue this series into a Cascadian... Cas... Not... Cascadian badge? The Misty's badge. But until next time, everyone. Peace.